Hello everyone, this is Sarfraz from Aristotle Prep and we are looking at question 135 from the OG13 RC chapter. In case you haven't understood this passage properly, uh, please watch the video for question 134 uh, in which I discuss the passage in great detail. So the question says in the passage, the author anticipates which of the following as a possible objection to her argument. I remember this in the second paragraph, last sentence, where the author says um, people would uh, people might say that why will uh, industrial workers who have steady jobs want to shift to uh, another areas which she then goes on to explain why they may do that in the third paragraph so that is the objection that she anticipates so a says it is uncertain how many people actually migrated no b says the eventual economic status of the great migration migrants has not been raised no c says it is not likely that people with steady job would have reason to move to another area of the country. That is your answer. That is what we predicted. D says, it is not true that the term manufacturing and mechanical pursuits actually encompasses the entire sector. No. E says, of the African-American workers living in southern cities, only those in a small number of trades were threatened by obsolescence. Absolutely not. C clearly is your answer. You should have been able to predict it if you understood the passage the way we did.